Hi guys, good morning. So today I'm going to be cleaning the dirtiest thing in this house. No, look at your cutting. I see that cutting here. Uh huh. So this chair and that cutting, which one is the dirtiest? Hey guys, <laughs> she's wrong. That's the dirtiest thing in the house, and she's not looking at it. Um, I'm getting cleaners over anyway. I'm getting professional cleaners to come and clean the dirtiest item in this house no but actually the curtains are dirty but the curtains are not dirty with dirt the curtains are dusty but actual dirt food particles um orishi orishi oil hand rubbish food matching on the on the chair like okay anyway let me even just go straight to the point the dirtiest thing in this house according to me are the chairs okay and that's because my kids you know stay here most of the time they play here they have their friends over all of them play here they eat here they eat snacks here if you open in between these chairs here you just vomit <laughs> it's so bad that i actually avoid sitting on this chair like if i don't have to sit on these chairs i don't sit on them because it is very disgusting to me but today finally i'm going to be having prime star over um you guys will know the owner of prime star she's Chidema, she followed us on vacation. She went on vacation with us. Um, yeah, so this is her day job. So this is what she does for a living <laughs> and other things as well. She has a laundry. Abby? Yeah, she has a laundry and she also has delivery company. So she's a serious businesswoman. Though. Forget all those bum bum chicken she was doing in, in, uh, <laughs> in Zanzibar. She's actually a very serious businesswoman. So um, her cleaning outfits, they're coming over today to come and clean these couches because just look at them. They are not made of leather, they are made of fabric, so I feel like they have sucked up a lot of dirt, a lot of nyama nyama. Okay, so today they are coming to clean it up. Baby, if you are so concerned about that curtain, why don't you call the people that are going to bring it down and clean it? This, uh -huh. this chilima that is coming to clean these chairs now, she can actually, her people can actually bring it down and wash it. She has a laundry this thing. They can actually bring it down and wash why it. Why are you not telling them to clean it down and wash it? That one is you that will do it now. Or maybe we should just change these chairs to leather chairs. I know. Mm, leather chairs are not even expensive. The TV I want to buy is more expensive than the food. That reminds me, you guys, my kids have spoiled the TV again. This time there's no visible crack, but I don't know what they do to the TV, but the TV has spoiled. And left for me, oh, it's okay. Two TVs in how many years? It's not two years. No, no. This TV we bought 28 months ago. This one. 28 months, not two years. Okay. Two years, four months. Okay. That's that's if I if you calculate and you are paying GSTV subscription, that is even more than 10k. It's like 10 10k a month. So it has you don't try. Anyway, this TV has stayed okay. Three two TVs in three years or in four years, whatever. Four years. In four years. For me, it is too much. And left for me, they should watch it like that. Let me show you guys how the thing looks. And you know that this Sophia is to clean here, exactly, especially here. So I think it's Sophia Asha. See how the TV shows. Terrible. So he said he wants to go and buy another TV for them. For me, it is a waste of money, but okay. Let's not be that. I'm the bad belly that does not want them to enjoy. That I means when you buy the new TV, what we're going to do is you know that iron thing they used to put, so use that guard. <laughs> go and put burglary proof. Let me see if it's the people that I'm waiting for that have come.
So guys, they have finished washing the That's chairs the and the chairs are currently... What are you doing? What are you doing? Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> say hi. I said say hi. <laughs> I said say hi. <laughs> say hi. Hi. <laughs> Every time you're always wearing this. Anyway, um, yeah, they just finished washing the chairs now and the chairs are very clean. I'm really excited that I did this because I was on the verge of throwing those chairs away because of how yucky those chairs were. Because of you and you. <laughs> You're laughing. Hmm? Are you a nyam nyama girl? No. So why are you always doing disgusting things? You were to any. In fact, because of those chairs, I now had to ban them from eating upstairs. So now they eat on the dining table downstairs. I had to ban them from eating upstairs. But it's not everything they eat downstairs. Like when they give them snacks and stuff, they eat it upstairs. And when their friends come, they eat upstairs. So they will now, after eating, they use the chair as their hand towel. <laughs> you know what you used to do? No. You used to use the chair as your rag. No. When they drink water in the chair, everything like that chair was really, really disgusting. But right now it looks very clean. Thankfully, the sun is really, really hot, so the chairs are going to dry very well. I'm so excited! <laughs> I'm really, really happy because this place is going to be smelling nice. Because, like I said, I've been avoiding this parlor because of the smelliness, okay? That's why even when the TV broke, I was like, okay, let everybody rest. Let them even avoid this place. Our dining, I wanted to turn our dining into a playroom. But my husband is fighting against it and we want to buy a new fridge so we might not we might not end up doing that but me i really want to turn into a play room i have so many things to do with money i need like 70 billion dollars because there's so many things i need to do with money and i don't have the money right now okay but anyway thank god i've done these chairs first so here is going to be livable at least even though this place is still a place that i generally avoid because <laughs> Um, is even here I should actually turn to a playroom for these kids. I actually, the only reason why I haven't turned here into a playroom is because of this open place. And I feel like once you dedicate here, once you make here like a dedicated playroom, they'll start exploring going to that place. So that's why I haven't turned here into a playroom because ordinarily this parlor is for them. Nobody stays here. The adults in this house don't usually stay here. We're usually in our room watching our tab and our I mean watching our phones and our laptops um the living room downstairs that one is just a joke that place is just for fancy <laughs> this is the carton for the tv that has spoiled they said that to repair this tv is 300 and something k to repair so what's the point wow. is it not time to sleep no. today is lesson you need to go and sleep no, no. baby I'm staying here baby Cora says she doesn't want to go and sleep I'm Stay here, stay here. Cause I'm doing video now. I'm doing video. Give me the camera. Give me the camera. Give me the camera. Your head looks like a spider. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah.